everyone, it's Scarlett OPS and today I'm going to be doing a charting. So first I have these two really nice paintings. The first one I have is a sushi one and it's got little stars and some salmon. So it's really really sweet and it's painted baby blue. So the next one I have is this little sushi and this is my favorite. It's got a little white face and it's really cute. It's got a little love heart and it's got some filling in it which is really really cute. So then I have this glass bottle charm filled with really really cute um, pink beads and little cabbage charms. So this is really sweet and this is filled with glue inside so it's not meant to dry, it's meant to move. And I thought this was really cool so if you guys would like a tutorial then comment down below. So next I have this really nice orange bow and I made this myself so it's really really cute. Then I have this other one. This one didn't turn out so well because the fabric I used for this didn't really make a good bow. But anyways, so they're my bow rings. So then I have these red rose earrings. And I might sell these on my Etsy if anyone wants them so they are really really sweet. So then I have these other roses, and they look like that. So next I have these pretty blue rose earrings. And that's all the earrings I have. So then I have this Palmer Clay Macaroon, and this turned out alright. Next I have this really adorable mermaid, and she's got a glittery tail and a glittery little shell top. So I think she's really sweet. Then I have this blonde one, which didn't turn out so well. There are a few mistakes. There's some on her hair, and her eyes a bit smudged. But anyways, so then I made this really cool bow. So I did like pink around the beige, and beige around the pink, and I thought it looked pretty cool, the effect that it made. So yeah. So then I made this squishy bun which I made a tutorial on, and if you guys want to check that out, then you guys can go to my channel. So then I made this cupcake with strawberry frosting, and it's pretty cute. So then I made this other cupcake, which didn't turn out so well, but it's still cute. So there, for, there are all my Palmer Clay charms. So now I have some molds to show you. First I have this rose mold, and I don't really like the Sculpey Mold Maker. It doesn't really pick up much detail, but anyways. So then I made this small star mold, and I haven't tried this out yet, so I hope it's good. And it's nice and squishy. So then I have this toast mold, and I'm not sure what this is like, so I'm going to try this out soon. So there are all the molds I made. Squishies! So, I recently bought a package off the internet and I got heaps of squishies. So I'm going to show you some. So I have this nice squishy with chocolate. <laughs> so then I have this funny looking hamburger. And then I have this really cute squishy bun, and she's nicely textured and shaded, and she's very squishy, which is nice. I'm a squishy bun in a squishy world! And then I have this other one, which is also very squishy, and is nicely shaded and textured. Then I have this squishy melon pan, and the face is really cute, and the texturing and shading is done really well. Wow, this is fun! So then I have this one, and this one's really cute. Its facial expression is sweet, and it's also nicely shaded, and yeah, and it's very squishy. So then I have this one, and this one is also very squidgy, 
and nicely shaded and very well textured. So lastly I have this small one and it's really cute, it's really squishy and yeah. So there are all of the squishies I got and that's all for this charm update. So thanks for watching!